Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com and this is my daily stocks signals video for Tuesday the 11th of September where I just take one of our many signals that our members get every single day in our stock scanner membership area. In the members area itself, we our members get to download potential long fifth wave trades and short fifth wave trades on the 60 minute, the daily and the weekly time frames. The fifth wave is the highest probability move in an Elliott wave sequence and in a trend. Also, we give signals for stochastic longs and stochastic shorts on intraday time frames. And look at the shorts today. So in the members area here for the 11th of September, as I say, just click on the image, download the spreadsheet. The spreadsheet for today looks something like this. I'm concentrating on the 60 minute time frame for the shorts today. As we are negative going into the open of today's session with uh, futures quite a bit lower at the moment. So I've chosen just one of these to go through and set up on our charts. I've chosen LB, L Brands Inc. So let's go through to the chart. So first of all, this is the Wave 5 Trade Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the Ninja Trader NT8 platform. As you can see, I've isolated the, the start of our wave count here on, um, on this high around about the 21st of August. And then our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite has automatically counted the wave count. And we're on this important Wave 4 pullback right now. I'm just going to go and set this up on a different version on our Thinkorswim platform just to show the versatility and the very similar nature of these different platforms with our Indicator Suite. So this is the Thinkorswim version. As you can see here, we've had the Wave 4 pullback. And that's one of our first filters for our stock scanner membership in that we've had a way a pullback against that main um, bearish trend in this in this case. The wave force found resistance in our green zone. We have amber and red as well. The green zone represents an 85 percent probability. If that resistance is found, it starts to move back down again. There's an 85 percent probability it's going to go on and hit our wave five trade target. And also here down in blue, the next filter is our 535 oscillator, which basically measures the performance and the um, and how the wave four behaves. So what we do is we pull back between 90 and 140 percent. As you can see here, we've actually crowned before the 140 yesterday and starting to come back down. The next filter is the stochastic. Now the stochastic has a yellow bar at the bottom denoting a very strong bearish trend. It's pulled back against there into the overbought zone. And it's crossed over and it's looking, you know, it's likely to want to get back to that main bearish trend. So there are the three main basic filters. Then we have to look, have a look for entry. So the, first of all, with the entry strategy, the stop loss has to be above the wave four high, so around about 28.13 for the stop loss. The entry has to be outside of our 6.4 moving average low, the red moving average here on our indicator suite. That for the first bar position today is way below, but we all, I also wanted to be below the low of yesterday here and below uh, the whole $27 mark for me really. So 26.95 is the entry short for LB. Target is around about $25, so a risk to reward of 1 to 1.6, a very conservative entry strategy. Some people will be very aggressive coming out of this 6.4 moving average high for the first bar position and look for an entry around about 27.41. But for me, I just want to confirm that movement away from that wave 4, see the first candle or so come down. The more crowning on our 5.35 oscillator gives me more confidence of the short trade. So that's it for today. Short setup on LB on the 60 minute time frame for a short. Stop loss 28.13, entry 26.95 and the target's around $25. Simple, very, very simple setup from our stock scanner membership and using one of our LE Wave indicator suites for Thinkorswim, Ninja Trade. It's also available for TradeStation and Multicharts. So have a great training day. Speak to you all tomorrow.